I have an announcement. I'm leaving the lab. All right, so it's Monday here at the lab, and we have processed a ton of film. We got a few things we want to share with you guys today, so we will turn it over to Ava. Hi, I'm push processing film. We have Aurora 800 that we're pushing to 1600 for someone. I don't remember his name. Yeah, how many did he have today? Like 11. 11. It's our fault, though, because we put out the Aurora video, and you and I pushed the yes, film to 1600. So we've inspired him, and I think here is the film. And how many are you through right now? Uh, I think this is the fourth. The fourth one? Maybe the fifth one. Are you in the middle of it right now? Yeah. Yeah. We're going to show off, like, how many rolls of film we did today. Should we turn that yeah. over to John? All right, so... Turn over to John? The twin check labels. Oh, right, oh right, yeah, right, yeah. Right, right. I knew about this. So we have these twin check labels, and, uh, you know, every roll gets uh a sticker and this is how many rolls or how many rolls of film that we did I don't just think it was a full day was it even? today I, no oh it may I even be longer a half day it was a like half, half day. of the day because you guys just burned to that second chunk so our goal is to see how many days it takes to get all the way to the door i don't I'm think it'll take long not even the week not even the week i don't think it'll be a week i think by thursday yeah ready <laughs> We're trying to see if it'll reach the door. Oh, we got it. We got it. Oh, you got it. Wait, wait, wait. I don't want it to rip. <laughs> Dave, I don't... No! No! I don't know. Almost to the door. We're, we're so close. Definitely did a ton of film today. Um, but I have an announcement. I'm leaving the lab for two weeks. The staff are going to be running the lab without me. They're going to do great, but I am going on a trip to New Zealand to do a Middle Earth tour. So uh, I kind of wanted to go over today the cameras that I'm contemplating bringing, pick one, and talk about why. About a year and a half ago, I think. It's been about a year and a half. Yeah, it's been a while. Uh, my wife finally convinced me to book a tour for a Lord of the Rings movie tour, two weeks in New Zealand. And these are the cameras that we have here at the lab. So camera option number one is a Hasselblad 503CX. Uh, we actually bought this as a lab from one of our local photographers, Jonathan DeHaight. Uh, he's an amazing photographer. Every time we scan his film, John, Jonathan DeHaight. Yeah. Amazing photographer. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Are you draining the fluids right now? Yeah, just really quickly. He's uh, getting rid of some of our waste tanks today, but this is a camera we are considering. Uh, the Leica M6, this is also a lab camera slash I kind of bought it personally for me. And then the Contax 645. So two of these are medium format cameras uh, that uses 120 film, it's a little bit bigger. I have been thinking about which camera to use. John, which camera do you think I'm taking? Leica. Leica. John? Leica, Leica? Leica. Yeah, Leica. <laughs> Uh, so the main like reason I'm taking this is because we will be gone for two weeks and we're trying to travel light. We're actually only bringing a carry-on and we're going to be staying in hotels, going to have to do laundry halfway through. So I want to travel light, so I'm taking the Leica M6 and going to document the process. And so this is going to be a little mini-series of going around New Zealand, Middle Earth, where Lord of the Rings was filmed. I'm shot on film, so I'm going to be shooting you on film. And I want each of the staff members to pick a roll of film that I have to shoot. Oh. oh. I know, because I already know what I'm picking. I know, it's all- it's still 400 days. Nope. No. Nope. Oh, so you no. you guys have to pick a roll for me to shoot and I will shoot it in honor of you. Oh, if it's an honor, I was gonna make one a really difficult. I was gonna do that, that, oh, that, that like film. five oh, ISO one. Film. I was gonna do the sun <laughs> film. I was gonna have him shoot the sun <laughs> film. I literally barely even scanned. No, I'm sun not gonna film. do that one. I was I'm going to. I'm with that sun film though, so no, do that. All right, so you guys have to pick a role. I'm gonna, I have some of my roles I picked. I already know. We already know he's got a couple of uh, All right. like HP5. I'll show you, yeah. show you Delta what Delta 400. Right, let me show you what I'm bringing. You have a trip, definitely. Yeah. Definitely mm -hmm. some Portra 400. Of course. Uh, the trip starts out day one, you actually go to Hobbiton and I'm hoping it's super sunny. And if it is. Oh. Yes, yeah. could have called that one. Could have called that one. I talk about this one a lot. So Delta cool. 100. Yep. Uh, such a colorful scenery. 
Yeah. I do have to bring black and white. You're right. It's going to be Delta 100. So these are going to be somewhat of my main shooters. Portrait 400, just kind of a daily shooter. Ektar, and then black and white. You're gonna have. You're gonna. I do have another. So... You have another Leica here at the store, so I may bring a second camera just as a backup. Not that I expect anything to happen <laughs> to it. Uh, but the lenses, I'm gonna have a 75 millimeter Voigtlander 1.5. That's a lot of glass. So that one's gonna be nice pretty pretty cool. Uh, I don't have it with me today, but I'm bringing a 50 millimeter and a 35 millimeter uh, Leica lenses. So. Staff get to pick. What am I? What do I have to shoot? John was gonna make it hard, but I was going to do it. I was like, it. no. I'm gonna purple because if you go to I the Shire to and I got all I that gotta shoot this in the Shire. Where's that at? Oh, I don't know if we have any in stock. I'll get a. Uh, you know what? No, I'll bring one in from my personal stash because Lomachrome purple needs to be shot. I've seen a roll, and I would like to see it to the Lenka. We have to get that roll. All right, all right. Um, I'm going to do another Actually, one, though. I have, I all right, pick another one. Oh, see, I want to do the sun film just to see how it turns out because I've never seen it turn out well. Well, keep in mind, so right now for us here in Florida or the Northern Hemisphere, we're going into summer. But New Zealand, they're in the Southern Hemisphere. They are going into winter. So it's going to be a little yeah. cold. Is it so big green? Uh, as of now, photos I've seen of Hobbiton are still green. Okay. So yeah. Phoenix might be interesting. I was thinking the Phoenix too. There might be some more cool color pops depending on the Phoenix. So are you yeah, picking this I'll one? Do. All right, so I got I got to shoot a roll of Harbin Phoenix. Boom. All right, Ava. Contemplating. Do the Aurora sixteen hundred. Aurora, but sixteen hundred. All right, you gotta grab it. Since we, we push process like 11 of these today. I have my mind all day. We're not letting you push process this. We're in Crucible, but this is normal. It, no, Ava says I have to, <laughs> no. I have to shoot it at 1600. Oh, you have to? Yeah. Oh. Well, you can, you're can. you pushing that then. I'll, I'll push, push it, it's fine. And I push it on the other one. What film are you picking? Oh. I want it to be good. <laughs> I Ooh, I know another one you could do. But I'm like, oh, oh, it. Try to think of it. Are you thinking more? Yeah, <laughs> I, I, have a bun I have a bunch of different ones. I've, I've gone through my head of like, Sly would be really cool too. Sly. Ooh. I was thinking like, like that guy's in that Scotland film and I feel like it's the same vibe. Do we have Sly? We have the FPP. No. No, the Fluk film. And also, Chrome. I mean, 35 millimeter. Yeah. Oh, we also right? have Ectochrome. This one actually will be good. I think technically it is Ectochrome film. They take the cinema slide film that Kodak makes and it's just a lot cheaper so if you like slide film definitely save money on this but yeah I didn't even think about shooting some slide film uh, flick film chrome so definitely I'll shoot that that was your second choice yeah I'm I'm done. Done. I get one of your personal stash yeah, and now so I'm wait, one one one. yeah so okay all right all right so that's, oh, that's a good a snap so far. no that's a lot of fun. all right Sears Sears got to think about it Two weeks. I I'd burn through that in like two weeks. If I was in, if I was shooting in the Shire, I'd burn. Or if I was shooting in New Zealand, I'd burn through that probably in like two four days. days. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna be shooting a lot of film. So, you know what could look cool too? Who though? wants to do the it's honors on the letter we got? During the day, of course you would. A hundred T during the day. It could, but it also may just look weird. But if you ever shoot at night, where's that? Michael's a pro, so I think he'll make it look good. Yeah. If you shoot at night at all, so just, Ava, I just keep adding. <laughs> Ava, I just keep saying things. Honestly, I'm tempted to say like gold or ultra banks. Like those are such solid films. What? He's he's bringing other solid films. No, I know. Be unique. It's all right. One other thing we wanted to share with you guys today is we got a really cool letter in from Brian Sharp from Gray, Tennessee. He's been watching our YouTube and he sent us a really nice typed out letter and a Polaroid for the wall of film, all this in stack square. Uh, but he just says, Dear Reform Film Lab, I just wanted to say thank you so much for all that you do. I found you via your YouTube videos and social media posts. I'm so glad that I did. We don't have any film stores within hundreds of miles of me, and there are any photographers to share my love of photography. 
So finding y'all is like finding new friends. Uh, previously, I've had to send my film off to a lab in California, and they did a great job, but it felt impersonal. So we drive from East Tennessee to Orlando a few times a year. Uh, Orlando is only an hour away from us to vacation. And my daughter is looking to possibly attend UCF. Go Knights. <laughs> my wife graduated from UCF, so that's a good pick. Uh, so you guys feel like a local lab, even though currently we're nine hours away. Uh, we're driving up here soon to visit you guys. He kind of talks about some vacation plans that they have and some cameras that he's shooting. And then he included a photo today of uh, a tour of their original post office. I didn't even notice that. You know, the original post office in his hometown. He also included a sticker of his business. It's a personal operation, a music lesson studio called Great Scott. Great Scott! Great Scott! <laughs> Right, makes me think of yeah. you know, talking about Great the Scott. Great Scott. Uh, I'm hoping to make it onto your sticker collection and be part of the family. Thank you for your content, your awesome work, and for just being great people. You guys make film fun. So, thank you, Brian. I never knew I could write anything so no, no, Doc, it's beautiful. So, we are going to put these on. But before we do that, I think Sierra's made her decision. All right. So, I mean, it feels weird that you're not gonna bring our film okay so from day shots and since john and Ava got to bring more than one uh maybe no 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 mirage I, I don't know what effects this one specifically has but the picture on that size okay yeah the kono films they're pre-exposed with different tents so that'd be a good one they're too expensive <laughs> <laughs> they are a little pricey a little pricey all right so we have some stickers <laughs> here we go you guys want to go rock them All right, so first one is uh, from Scott, the uh, his music studio. So that's going to go on. Ava's still push processing Phil. Let's stay over here for a while. So what we what tell them what we have to do when we push process film. It's different. Uh, we have to make sure the machine's empty, and then we put the film in that we're going to be pushing. Uh, wait for it to get all the way into the developer, then we actually turn off the film drive that moves it through the machine, so it sits in the developer for one more minute, and then we time it, and then put it back on, and it goes all the way through. Yep, so we don't charge for post-processing, even though it's a little bit of extra work. Uh, we just make Ava do it, because she's like the perfect height <laughs> for it. So. All right, sticker number one. Oh, I feel like it needs to go here. We kind of got this. Welcome. All right, Sierra, you got the Okay, and then we have two from Ryan Tempro. He's sent us two with two recent orders. So, um, this one I feel like it should go here with the, with the circles. Right. John, do you want to do the other one? Uh, yes, yeah. No, John has to do it. John has to do it? Okay. I've already put one on this week. So, just what? Right. And there we go. And okay. Ava, put on the last one. Nope, I'm, I'm about to Come on, Sierra, first. just do it again. John, you do it. I'm holding the camera, I can't. No, no, Sierra. I totally couldn't pass Sierra is a sticker person. I am? Yeah, see, put on like most of them on. I feel like it's decently even between me and Michael. Exactly, it's a one wide switch it up. <laughs> no need to have me do it. I just don't want to do it. Exactly. Look. I think great. You're some now, but you can just be our best. Okay. There we go. Boom. <laughs> He's ready for Middle Earth. So I'm ready. Embarking on his adventure. I'm ready to go on an adventure. We're going to I love you guys. Have fun running the lab. And I'll see you in two weeks. Bye. Bye. We're partying tonight, right? Yep. And there he goes. We're partying, right? Yeah. That was sure. Great. great. Party. <laughs> Back so soon. I forgot my cards. <laughs> <laughs>